Whether it's a sandy beach or a mountain peak, tens of millions are planning a special getaway just in time for Independence Day. We're expecting a very busy Independence Day weekend. AAA is projecting that nearly 42 million Americans will take a trip this year. It's the most since 2007. Millions taking to the skies or rails, but even more will be hitting the highways to get there. The dominant mode of transportation is the automobile. About 85% of travelers, or 35.5 million Americans, are going to take their own car to their destination. And for those drivers that gurgle at the gas pump, maybe music to their ears. The current price for a gallon of gas is about $2.78 a gallon. That's 88 cents cheaper than it was at July 4th last year. But as AAA found, some of that money saved may end up going to where you're going. Hotel rates are expected to be moderately higher this year. Mid-range hotels are priced about 9% higher than they were for July 4th last year. But for many, just getting away may be worth the cost. Everybody's doing pretty much what they want to instead of planning their trips like they used to. I don't think it's a bit of a deterrent. I think people will go as they want to go. So whether it's with fireworks lighting up the night sky or just the fire under the grill poolside, However you celebrate this July 4th, expect to see a lot of fellow travelers as you make your way to your destination. Dan Shenneman, NBC News.